A Boardman mother was charged after investigators say her child was found duct taped to a chair in the basement. It's been a popular story today on the WKBN app and website, and it turns out the suspect's mother called police for help. I was in court today where Susan Malaysia had a lot to say. Susan Malaysia stood in front of a judge and heard she was charged with child endangering. The 32-year-old was ready to talk. Can I speak about it or no? No, now's not a time to talk about the incident. Susan was accused of leaving an 11-year-old child home alone yesterday. The police report says Susan's mother wanted to take the child to lunch and got concerned when she wasn't allowed. She went to the house on Roach Way and found the child in the basement. The child uh, had duct tape uh, around each ankle, uh, uh, duct taping him to the chair. He had his hands or wrists duct taped together, and he had a piece of duct tape across his mouth. Police are still trying to determine how long he was tied up. The grandmother wanted officers to see him in that condition. They found a roll of tape and scissors nearby. The boy was cut loose and is okay. Next, police went looking for Susan. They arrested her at the Boardman YMCA. She was swimming in the outside pool with her younger daughter. While Susan went to jail, both children are now being taken care of by other relatives and police believe they're safe. Susan was given a $10,000 bond and the prosecutors asked for another restriction. We would also ask that a condition of bond be added that the defendant have no contact um, with the children, with the, either of her children. That was granted, but Susan wasn't going to leave without trying to get this finished as quick as possible. The next thing to do was set a preliminary hearing. Do you want more time or do you want your hearing held in 10 days? Can I have it for this Thursday? Well, the best the court could do was arrange that hearing for next Tuesday. The court also agreed to seal the case file right now so nobody can see the pictures which were taken of the boy duct taped to the chair by police. They have investigated another incident from a year ago with Susan Malaysia and the same child. She wasn't arrested for that, but police plan to ask the child more questions about it now.